What's going on guys? So uh, today I'm doing some uh, closet clean out and I have uh, food preps and water stored all over my house as well as other locations and I'm just going through it and I found a couple things I had to throw out uh, specifically some food that uh, mice got into. I didn't do a good enough job uh, securing that so that was garbage uh, and then threw stuff that was uh, kind of a rounded out just to be sure. This is a bunch of um, emergency drinking water from Datrex. All right, you can see this also expired. All right, this was made in 2010 and expired 2015. This is not a great way to, to store water anyway. I just happen to have a bunch of these, uh, but these were just in a like a milk crate in the closet, and they just went bad, so I'm just cutting them open. So there's no point in throwing out all the extra weight from the, uh, the water. But a good excuse to use my knives, right? So just uh, doing this in the sink. But I want to make a video just to remind everyone to go through your rations. A lot of people are into uh, all kinds of prepping stuff. All right, maybe you store you know, food and water like this. Maybe it's medicine, who knows? But you have to go through it and make sure it's good. So anyway, this is just a reminder for all the people out there that do prepping. Doesn't matter if you do some light prepping all the way down to, you know, you have a bunker. Make sure you go through your stuff. Make sure when that day comes, if you happen to need something, that it's not expired. All right, just like changing your batteries, that's something else too. Go through all your emergency flashlights, make sure the batteries are good. Make sure everything's charged up. Just, it's just a reminder, you know, every year, Daylight savings, people tell you, check your smoke alarms, make sure the batteries are good. It's kind of like that. Just another reminder to go through all of your prep stuff. But anyway, I'm going to finish off. I probably have twice of what uh, I already cut open here. Uh, and like I said, that'll get replaced. As far as the food's concerns, the food that got uh, broken into, there it was a bunch of packs of uh, freeze-dried uh, beef stew. And they're in foil, and I put those in a plastic bag, but that wasn't enough. The, uh, there's obviously a rogue mouse in the, uh, the closet, because this was deep, you know, back in the closet got into there and had himself a little snack and of course you know made a little bed in there and stuff so all that was thrown out uh, just again for precaution so there's no contamination or anything and obviously you need some nice thick you know buckets or something to store that kind of stuff so that you know rodents and bugs and stuff don't get in there but anyway it's pretty much it but good excuse to use another knife is that Kaiser you guys will eventually see a, a video on that so that's all just a reminder to go through all your stuff and make sure nothing's going bad if it has get rid of it and replace it hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video Take care, guys.